Hi guys and welcome back to another video. So today I've got five ball mastery skills that you can do at home to improve your body feints. Before we start, I just want to say a huge thank you to OneFootball for sponsoring this video. OneFootball is a free football app that you can download onto your smart device. It keeps you fully up to date in the world of football through news, transfer rumors, highlight videos, live scores, so you can keep tabs on your favorite team, leagues, and players. Absolutely free to download. Check out the link in my description to download it for yourself. The first exercise, we're just going to work on that body feint technique. So we're not even going to touch the ball. So it might feel a little bit strange doing that at first, but it's so important to get the mechanics down, really selling that body feint, because that's going to help you to perform them in a match and with the ball on the move. So keeping the ball still, all we're going to do is be light on our toes, then we're going to lunge to the side of the ball. So we're just on one leg, really lowering that shoulder, bend it in the knee, but enough so we can explode back. We want to be light on our feet, explode to the side of the ball, really selling it by dropping our shoulder, lowering our knee. That's going to make the defender think we're going to one side. So we're literally just working on that technique going from side to side. Once you get in a rhythm, try and go for 30 seconds without stopping. For exercise two, now we're going to get the ball on the move. So we're going to take a little touch with the outside of the foot, stop the ball, lunge to the side, and then we're going to push the ball with the outside of the opposite foot, stop the ball, lunge, push the ball, and then we're going to get in a rhythm. So we're working on that body fit as we stop the ball, then we're throwing our shoulder and our knee beside the ball, really lowering it, making the defender thinking we're going this way, then pushing the ball in the opposite way. Then once you get in the rhythm, go for 30 seconds without stopping. The third exercise works on a really effective body feint. So we're going to take a small touch with the inside of our foot, then we're going to lunge to the side with that same foot to make it look like we're going to go back in the same direction we just pushed the ball from. So a little touch, body feint, nice and low, shoulder low, and outside of the opposite foot, stop the ball, then we're going to go the opposite way. So inside the foot, lunge, outside the foot, stop. Inside the foot, lunge, outside the foot, stop. Then you're going to get in a rhythm, go for 30 seconds, without stopping. Exercise four, we're gonna be working on our inside step overs. Another really effective way to use our body to throw the defender to one side so that we can accelerate in the opposite direction. So we're throwing our foot over the ball, around the front of it, stepping, nice bend in the knee, dropping the shoulder, then outside the foot touch. Then the opposite leg goes around the front of the ball, nice low center of gravity, outside touch. Then we're gonna get in a rhythm like this. And the final body feint uses the inside of the foot. We're gonna slightly push it across our body, but it's not the movement of the ball that's gonna sell the defender, it's the movement of my body. So notice as I'm pushing it across, I'm leaning in that direction. That lean with my shoulder is really gonna make the defender think this is the direction I'm going. Then you'll notice at the last second, I snap the ball in the opposite way, and then I'm gonna use my opposite foot and do the exact same thing. So lean, push across and snap. Lean, push across, snap and you're going to go for 30 seconds without stopping.
So there we go guys, five ball mastery skills that you can use pretty much anywhere to work on your body feints. Make sure you check out the rest of my ball mastery training playlist so you can have more skills to do at home to get more confidence on the ball. Also check out my very own seven day ball mastery training programs, Maestro and Maestro 2.0 if you want a structured seven day program to take your ball mastery to the next level. Links to those will be in the description. But if you did enjoy today's video, make sure you smash the like button, hit the subscribe button for weekly training videos, and I will see you guys in my next video.